another vlog. We are in still in Nevada. We're going on a road trip. We're going on an adventure. <laughs> We're gonna see the Grand Canyons. I have uh, Ricardo's dad and Ricardo's dad's partner back here, and of course, our designated driver. <laughs> so we are heading to. I didn't plan this trip. Sion. So we're heading to Sion in Utah today, and then we're going to Bryce, Bryce and then down like all the way Arizona. down, yeah, all the way to Arizona. So we're doing like a four-day trip, and then we're flying back. We flew, flew, flew in to five-day trip. See, I cannot count. Uh, we flew into the, uh, Las Vegas, and now we are just getting our way down in this rental car to Phoenix and then we're gonna fly back. I literally have no idea about this trip because I have spent approximately 30 seconds planning this trip. It's been this one. It's the work of this one. He's been planning this. And it is like 6 o'clock in the morning. 6.30. Time flies when you're having fun. Is it Springdale? Springvale? Mm -hmm. One of those two. Springdale. Springdale. <laughs> and we're parking the car and we're taking some kind of shuttle to Scion Park. But it's kind of cold here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think I'm too used to Texas. I'm like, brr, chilly. filming against the sun so <laughs> don't mind me but we just did the what was it called the one we did the trail uh, west ridge west ridge uh, west, west rim but it was like the sp sp scouts something lookout scouts lookout yeah i think that was the one it was a little intense not gonna lie um not an exercising girly over here do not have time for that you know that um <laughs> maybe this tells me that i need to work less and jog more but we're having a little bit of break Ooh, i'm actually i've been drinking the liquid iv uh in a toyota bottle that we got when we bought our car actually i kind of like it i thought i wasn't gonna like it but you know what i'm i'm kind of a fan I've heard so many people talk about it. You know what? I kind of like it. So the other side of the road here is um, another place that we're going to go as well. It's the Emerald Pool, right? I'm pretty sure it's the Emerald Pool. We're just going to go to the first one and just see what it looks like. Hopefully this footage is showing you anything whatsoever. If not, just imagine that it's really pretty here. up to the last point the temple of Sinawaba Sinawaba sorry I'm having some air pretzels <laughs> we're doing the like the river sidewalk which is supposed to be super easy but it takes you to the narrows 
which is a more advanced one, right? But we're not gonna like do it. We're just gonna peek it. We're not gonna do all of it. It takes many hours. Yes. So we're just peeking. <laughs> So we are heading back. Oh my god, my hair is a mess. This was a cute little, very accessible and easy walk, which is good because that other one that we did, it was rough. Listen, I was in, I, I thought I was gonna have an aneurysm at one point. I was like, I'm too old for this. And then I'm like, with them, they're in such better shape than I am. But it's something for the future to get better at. See, this is why I need more me time to be able to get my cardio up a bit. But this has been lovely. What a lovely day. And we are going to take the bus back now. All the way back to the beginning. We're going to get to the car. We're going to find our hotel that is somewhere here in the vicinity. And hopefully get some dinner. I'm famished. had our coffee we are heading to is it called Bryce I think it's called Bryce I keep fluffing all of these up I don't know where we're going but this is the road I don't know you can see the road here but like this is the road look at how it is and they are over here like it is so very cool here I'm having my coffee I took a big coffee today a big cappuccino mm. Mm. look at this just it's straight up it's so cool it's Say hi. <laughs> Anyways, we're going to Bryce today. I'm told that it's a little less green, a little bit more like space. Can you tell that my hair is like... This is not the trick where I doll myself up. Just surviving here, peeps. <laughs> So we're in Bryce and we stopped at Sunrise Point, I think. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna watch whatever that is. It's so cold here. It's the temperature of our fridge. I've been, I've been bamboozled by the weather app. They're like, oh, it's gonna be warm. It's not, it's not warm. I'm cold. I'm regretting my life decisions. <laughs> but we're gonna go the most recommended little trail and just hopefully see a bunch of cool stuff. I will say the nature here, it's I don't want to say it looks like Sweden because it doesn't but like the vegetation is a little bit more Sweden-esque let's say
is us going from the is it I think it's sunrise to sunset point so we're like at gone down to almost the bottom and then come back up I hope I was able to show you in this video how steep it was um, but it was cool it was really cool and um, back to liquid IV but it's really beautiful I will say I think I prefer this one to Scion um, it's very very cool if you have to choose between the two I'd say this one it's a little bit more nature-esque it's prettier and it's less people we are at I think it's called Rainbow Point it's like the other end of Bryce Canyon and I think you can see or maybe you can't <laughs> it's literally a cliff here so we're gonna look at the view I think all of us are a little tired Ricardo keeps complaining about his thighs being shaky I will say my back is hurting and my toe is hurting <laughs> but my legs are pretty okay which is surprising ask me again in two days and we'll see <laughs> we'll see how I feel but still I think that Bryce is so gorgeous and I will say some of this like dry pine forest is some of my favorite type of vegetation absolutely adore it so let's go look at the view Are leaving um, this part <laughs> Bryce we've been staying here in this little house thing that Ricardo's dad is closing right now it's pretty good I haven't shown you anything inside any of the places we've been you can see the mountains in the back no you cannot trust me on this one there's mountains in the back <laughs> but we are heading out we're gonna grab some coffee and then we're heading down to what is it called antelope Antelope Canyon. That's the one that I look forward to the most because I love being close to weird rocks. Ooh, sorry about the wind, by the way. It's cold here. Ricardo did not tell me that we are getting into winter. <laughs> Are at Horseshoe Bend. We're gonna watch the supposedly most famous part of Grand Canyon right now and then we're going to the guided tour that we have at Antelope Canyon. So hopefully this will be worth the drive. I think so. <laughs> Expectations are high. Okay, so we just went on one of those trucks and you could see it was very, very bumpy, but we are going into the canyon right now and I'm very excited. It's literally a hole into the mountain and I cannot wait to see it.
heading to Grand Canyon, the actual national park, right? Mm -hmm. We've been staying in Flagstaff. I showed you our breakfast. <laughs> what I've been showing you this trip has been very sporadic. My feet are hurting. They're dying. I've literally been buying every kind of, I don't know, plasters and medication that's available to the market. So hopefully it will sort itself out. We'll see. We'll see what happens. But yeah, I'm going to show you what it looks like. Hopefully it will be somewhat pretty. What we're seeing right here pretty much looks like Sweden, but I'm fairly sure that what we're going to end up seeing today is not going to be like Sweden. <laughs> okay, so we're finally here after spending 2 million years trying to find a parking spot. <laughs> I will say so far this has been the most difficult park to visit, but this view is pretty dope. trail mm-hmm and who's almost killing their wife in this trail oh mm-hmm how many times have I fallen over <laughs> like do you see this my mom is gonna look at this and be like what she might disown you no I don't think this is passing any country's safety regulations <laughs> like look this is the trail and it's just going straight, like, this is just straight down. Like, there's even a trail here, there. Like, it's just madness. Who picked this? You did. <laughs> you did. <laughs> I think we lost your dad. He gave up, he went back up. Not gonna lie, I'm pretty tired. Take me home. Save me. Save me. I'm tired. That was rough. We are at desert point because apparently it was very very <laughs> we needed to see some kind of a view before the sun goes down but as you could see this is this is the sunset over here oh the camera is trying to overcompensate because it's very dark it's very dark and that's why it can't focus um, i'm cold i want a hot meal Preferably, I'd like hot cocoa. <laughs> I feel like I'm like whining right now, but my feet are hurting. My feet are hurting. My back is hurting. I just want a hot meal and a blanket. <laughs> We're in 
Sedona, we're having some crepes for breakfast. They're going walking, I'm staying here. My body is over, we're not, <laughs> we're not doing it. I want a resting day all by myself, but I'll show you the crepes I bought in the Tala one. Everybody else is doing something, benching, I'm like, no, sugar, please. Okay, so like I told you, I was not going on the hike. I needed a day on my own. Um, struggling a little bit on and off with my mental health this past couple of weeks, and I just needed a day by myself. So I got myself a matcha latte. This is probably the prettiest Starbucks in the world. And I got my book. I'm finally gonna finish my book. Let me show you my view from where I'm sitting. Look, I'm sitting here. Look at this view. Are you kidding me? <laughs> so we're just walking around in Sedona right now. They came back. Apparently it was really, really hard to go hiking here because it's so full of people and not enough parking. So they kind of gave up kind of quickly. So I think we're going to be moving on. We're trying to find Vanya right now. She went shopping somewhere and they don't know where. So we're trying to find her. And I think we might be heading into Phoenix a little early instead. We'll say Sedona is beautiful. But it's very touristy. There's a lot of people here, so don't expect that much solitude. Phoenix, we're having Mexican food. Hello! <laughs> Mexican food, and then we're heading to the flights, or to the airport. I think it's at seven o'clock tonight. This is filmed quite some time after we've come home, but Honestly, I just wanted to film like a proper outro. Ricardo's dad and Vanya, his partner, has left and I had so much fun at the trip, but it also was a little bit taxing on my mental health. I've been, I keep saying it and I know I'm like, I'm annoyed, so I can only imagine how annoyed you are. It's been so stressful as of late and I now have, I think about one and a half, two months in front of me where I'm just gonna be home very lovely with just my husband and my pets and just being at home. I think Bryce was my favorite park and I am still happy that I went even though I did at times feel very stressed about the whole thing. I also am not putting any ads on this video so this video is not monetized. If you see any ads that is YouTube putting ads on it. I have not put any ads on this because I did not talk about this during the vlog but there is a rule that you cannot I think like film commercial videos within national parks in the US and even though I don't know if a vlog counts as that I don't want to break a rule and I'm not making any money on my vlog channel anyways basically my vlog channel I would say breaks even pretty much because I do pay for a um, what would you call it? like a subscription to put the music on my vlogs because I think good music makes a good vlog but this video I opted to not put any ads on it so I'm not making any money whatsoever on this one I just want to keep the memories I want to save the memories and I do my vlogs for me and I mean that's why I keep doing vlogs even though I'm not making money on this channel because I do them for me I like doing vlogs I think it's fun and if you are here, if you are watching my videos, um, thank you. Thank you so much for being here on my vlog channel. It truly means a lot because I'm just literally just sharing a passion here, sharing my life, showing you a little bit behind the scenes. And I did also film a vlog when I went to Los Angeles with my friend Heather and went to the Glam Light Halloween party. So that vlog is going to be the next one coming up on my channel. And I hope you will enjoy that one too. And I hope you're having a great day. And I will see you soon in a new vlog. Bye!